What's the deal with airplane peanuts? Put your hands together for that young bull, Shane Gillis. Hey. I don't have much, because this is gay. <laughs> you went to Army yeah, as a recruited yeah, yeah, yeah. football player. Yeah. You grew up in Pennsylvania. What an amazing story. Yeah, we talked about it. That's funny. For... Technically, I do have a pretty fucking sick like resume. Yeah. Because I played, uh, it's D1 football, and then if you join West Point, if you join the Army during uh, active war, you are te technically, I'm a decorated veteran. That's a medal. That's sick. I quit right away. I quit West Point right away, first month. <laughs> and uh, then, you know, I got SNL. So technically, I'm a Division One football player that is a decorated veteran and was cast on Saturday Night Live. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I didn't do one of those things. <laughs> but that is my resume, technically. <laughs> this is Diane Michael Lerstein. I funk you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, your punchlines have to be strong, dude. <laughs> Just <laughs> such a long build up. Like, it yeah. better be a good. It if really you have a, is. Mediocre, a mediocre joke that we all waited 10 <laughs> minutes for, <laughs> that shit stinks. <laughs> It's that was so a funny good. joke, but it just was so long that by the end we were like, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so no one, Don't no. talk shit, dude. I know you're about to start talking shit. <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. What is good from... <laughs> yeah, yeah, good. I'm glad you can't talk no. shit, dude. <laughs> Yo, God's got my back on this one. Hey. <laughs> hey. You know what? I love from a fellow comedian when I'm doing my jokes, hearing their fucking beer open. <laughs> you fucking. I know, gosh. my bad, my bad. I went to Catholic school and kids would fucking faint. We had to go to church every week. And it was, there was no air conditioning. It was hot as uh, fuck. Yeah. Kids would faint non. And it's Catholic, so you're standing and kneeling, standing. Were you an altar boy? No, I wasn't. I, was, I got out of it. Oh, nice. Yeah, it was, I, I got caught in third grade drinking the wine. Damn. Yeah. The, third grade? The priest came in and he's like, What are you doing? He's like, Jackpot. Yeah, he was a little like, buzzed, <laughs> he was like, a little buzzed up. Yeah, I love that. <laughs> I wish we learned more about like European history in in school. That was what I I don't feel like we learned anything about yeah. what the hell happened with Europe. Less of all, what are you going to teach these kids? Yeah. Though? Think about teaching a class. Think of the girls in your class. <laughs> yeah, you can be like, hey kids, let's talk about Archduke Franz Ferdinand. <laughs> Dude, just remembering a cup that collection of words, I I failed yeah, the test. <laughs> I'm like Ferdinand Duker. <laughs> Yeah, I like that guy. He's got a hell of a fastball. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> His backhand can use some work. Yeah, dude, I, I I wish there was more of that. Japan, I, I, I tried to watch a documentary about the samurai. Yeah, that's fun. Yeah. You the, different warring, the different warring factions The new one. Yeah. What? The yeah, new one? Yeah. yeah, I didn't start it yet. Yeah. That's things you, you should consume when you get older and then go, oh, now it makes sense back when I was younger. Yeah. You shouldn't start that when you're young. You should learn like CPR and how to cook. <laughs> yeah. Catholic school is dog <laughs> shit, dude. Yeah. Literally, it's I went to, I, to, to, to this day. I've I've only gotten through like a thirty seconds of a tutorial of how to properly save someone using CPR. Well, they yeah. change they, it. They have to change it all the time because no yeah, one, now no you one don't will have to ever like, do it in person. Yeah, no kissing. Now, now you don't have to kiss. Have to kiss. No <laughs> mouth to mouth. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. the best part. You just hit the stool. <laughs> yeah, kiss it. You told me you wouldn't. You wouldn't give your mom. <laughs> 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 be like, what's he doing? <laughs> oh, no, nah, the kids are because of COVID? Because of COVID? <laughs> For the people who are listening who can't see this right now, there is a that gives me. I don't anxiety. know, Shane. Do you want to set this up for the people who like what, what we're looking at right now? For the people who can't see, uh, drunk dude dropped his hat 
and uh, used, I don't know, used his shitty friend to help him <laughs> fucking try. I don't know. I don't want to set it's it up. Friends- <laughs> it's, dumb. It's, it's dumb friends holding him by an, one arm and one leg, dangling yeah. him in onto the tracks where head first where he is straining to reach his honestly hideous hat. Yeah. And it's then it's such an ugly hat. Pulls him sideways. If a train were coming, his friend would panic, try to pull him back instead of to the side and he would fucking die. What would it yeah. take? Well, Shane, what would it take for you to, would it, would it be It'd a be phone? Tough. Would it be, be tough? No, fuck no. Phone, absolutely not. Mm-mm. No, it'd have to be like a fucking human. Yeah. It would have to be a human. It'd have to be you. a white human. <laughs> <laughs> I went to the Ciro Gan, Francis Ngannou fight with Rogan. So I was front. It was just me to the cage. I was sitting in front of the cage and it's terrifying, bro. It's so scary. Especially with you the see those dudes get, get in there. Beast. You're like every, and it's funny cause you could see my face the whole event so everybody was texting me like yo relax like, <laughs> the whole fight i was like, <laughs> like just a, le- a checked leg kick i was like <laughs> it was just, just not enjoying it dude, at all just like, it was terrifying no but the noise is the noise is disgusting so scary when you hear someone get punched in the chest in the belly it's it's disgusting. When you hear Shane Gillis go, stop! Yeah, I'm saying, hey! No, 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 run, 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 get out! You don't need this. Go. You're still young, <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah, it was bad. Uh, what do you do in the shadows, you fucking vampire? <laughs> <laughs> you're you're 26. So do you put a sock on the door to let your mom know you're jerking off, or what? <laughs> yes. Uh, yeah. Do you really? No, I was just trying to go along with what you said. <laughs> what is it like? You have you ever gotten caught masturbating at home? Yes, I have. What was that like? Can you can you describe to us what that moment was? Did you like? turn into a bat <laughs> <laughs> and escape the room? <laughs> Count Wacula. <laughs> there we go. Here we go. I'm I'm fired up. <laughs> It was a hurricane. It was yeah. Hurricane Barry. It, it was crazy. I got to just paint the picture of what it, because Tommy, Tommy Pope and I, past guests on the show, were just kind of like, you know, bullshitting. You got the guys on the couch. We're having a good time. We knew Shane was going to come in late, but we had no idea what's happening in the outside world. And Shane walks in dripping, like like uh, covered in water <laughs> as if he just got out of it a was bath. A, as if I was underwater. Like a dad that just lost his family. Like truly that upset, head down, and it, I'm just looking through oh, the man. wall. It's the funniest fucking image I've ever seen in my life. I went from... Yeah, never mind. Wet, sad, <laughs> yeah, sh- wet, sad Shane has got to be one of the funniest <laughs> visions. It's tough, man. I got to say, your hair fell in, right into place, though. It did look nice. Yeah. I was, that's because I was fucking doing that when I walked in, and then I looked in the in the monitor, and I was like, oh, nice. <laughs> <laughs> I should actually do my hair once before I lose it next week. <laughs> but Jesus that's the thing. Christ. Post-rain hair might be the greatest your hair could ever be. Yeah, it's when very got, difficult I'm, My to hair's recreate. thinning. When my hair gets wet, it's fucking insanely. Like, you can just, it's like bald. It's oh, bald. see, oh, scalp? Yeah, totally. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like, if I'm, if I'm in a pool, I look like I'm like 58. It's <laughs> <laughs> <That's> fucking crazy. Because <laughs> it sops down to that part of yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, fuck. <laughs> that sucks when it all just cuts, like, it, it just clumps together just, and you yeah. see the top of your scalp. You're like, oh, you're this, like, is, all this is like a loose leaf on top of a hole. That's what your hair is. It's like a trick. Like, I walk, like, if I'm at the pool, I look like just like a fat 12 year old walking around sure. and then if I jump in and like come out of the water it's like Jesus Christ it's like What's 75 that water? <laughs> yeah, yeah. the chlorine is aging this, people yeah, 50 this, years this pool in Chernobyl <laughs> Chernobyl I'd like to thank Ari and his people for this beautiful weather thank you Ari used to host the show, This Is Not Happening, a show named after his comedy career. (laughs) Ari is edgy and shocking, which is a really cool thing for a 50-year-old guy to be. (laughs) Isn't it cool? Touch football is preposterous. For kids? Yes. It's crazy. It's outrageous. I would would honestly come out and flog. If I saw a bunch of kids playing touch, I'd come out and fucking like... Say, hey, start hitting. Get the fuck out of here. Lower Start your head. Hitting. Lower your shoulder. Yeah, lower, lower, yeah, not your head. Lower your shoulder. <laughs> then my one friend, Mike Connolly, got hit puberty. <sighs> he was not allowed to play anymore. He was like, <laughs> we started secretly playing tackle football. With, we started secretly playing football without him. 
And occasionally be like, hey, can I come over? And we'd be like, dude, get out of here. Yeah, no way. That was, was sick. so good. Dude, peeping out dude's armpit hair in the pool was always just devastating. And making fun of him being like, dude, what do you, you come? Ew. <laughs> <laughs> see, I wasn't equipped with any of that. I would see them and be like, we made fun of him for coming. Where the fuck is my hair? Why oh, really? can't I come? Dude, I was trying to come way of before. Of course, but it was, he was the first one. So we were like, <laughs> you know, we were all jealous that he could come. <laughs> I, yeah, that's, that's funny. I didn't think about that playbook. I was just kind of like, I just I turned it inward. That's, that's been my playbook since day one. <laughs> it's a sick move. Dude. Once I realized I wasn't good at basketball, I was like, basketball is so fucking gay. I would like do layup lines at tryouts, just throw it against the backboard, and be like, this shit sucks, dude. <laughs> yeah. So the second I realized I'm not really good at something, I'm like, dude, anyone who does that is fucking gay for sure. <laughs> Oh my god! Yeah. That's such a sick move. Yeah, dancing? What am I a fucking homo? I'm not gonna dance or sing. <laughs> then someone's like, "You're a good singer." I'm like, <laughs> "Yeah, I guess that's kind yeah, of a maybe cool activity." Singing is fucking sick. <laughs> yeah. I wish we had a recording of an Australian dude getting upset with farts. Yeah, you know I, I mean? don't know. She's like, know oh, could you please to... stop?" <laughs> Passing gas at my cubicle. <laughs> like, That's actually a pretty good like any anybody that gets mad about a fart is a pussy, <laughs> unless it's a chick. And it's like I there was one time at football camp. That's a huge exclusion. I farted, <laughs> and my roommate because you you was at a, like a college dorm, and my roommate who I had no idea who he was, I farted like very loudly. <laughs> it was an offensive lineman camp. It was all big motherfuckers. <laughs> I farted extremely loud, and he was like. We don't do that here. Wow. Oh, no. So like, all right. All right, guys. I'm, I'm out. I'm switching rooms. Unoffensive yeah. lineman. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Wow. He's oh. an offended lineman. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Wow. Excuse me. Oh. Could you please stop? Yeah, I'm going to go to the FA Cup final. I've got my ticket. He's going to hate this because I've done nothing but talk. So even while I'm sat here talking to you, we've been very excited to get on. Most of my brain at the minute is singing Liverpool songs. I can't <laughs> turn it off. We're trying to win. You guys uh, fucking love singing. Oh, a hundred percent. The British, all you guys do is you get fucked up and no sing, no singing in the, uh, the in the NFL. No. Apart from the Chiefs fan being borderline racist. Yeah. Uh, we've not been told to stop. <laughs> yeah. We're not going to stop. Nah. <laughs> We're having fun. Yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah, like no this. singing. You guys love singing. You guys sing outside of football. Yeah, just in the bar. Everybody in the pub, yeah. Singing. On the way, on the coach down, on the plane. So me and Finn oh. went over to Spain this week when we it's played so for the Real. Because look, it is gay. <laughs> <laughs> singing with your boys is gay, but I'm just jealous. <laughs> I wish we sang, dude. Hang it's on. so fun. Anytime you guys are, like, I've been to a couple. Of, I've been to a bunch of soccer games, and every time everyone's singing, I'm like. <laughs> this is so cool, dude. <laughs> like I was at a Tottenham, they all started singing. I was like, this is incredible. Oh, see, now I really want to get you a ticket in our end for the FA dude. Cup final. They're not singing and show teach you tunes, the songs. though. What are they singing? <laughs> I don't I can't understand. They're one. not like, oh, Oklahoma. Like if that <laughs> yeah. if the Tottenham fans started singing that, I'd be like, this is a little camp. But it's no like, matter what they're singing, it's Oh come on. They're it, singing. No, but Liverpool sing like ABBA songs with different words, so it probably is a little bit come from. So some most of them, most football songs are a parody, yeah, of a, an original song. So the big Liverpool song at the minute, uh, the newest one, <laughs> is uh, how have we got here? A parody of the Beatles' "I Feel Fine." Mm. So Jürgen Jürgen said to me, "You know, we'll win the Premier League." You know, he said so. I'm in love with him. That is a bit gay. <laughs> 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 and I fuck, man. Yeah.